Stone Cold Steve Austin is being rumored to make a surprise appearance at WrestleMania 35. And there are also rumors that The Rock may finally return as well. But he will return to confront Stone Cold Steve Austin. Austin and The Rock will go back and forth on the microphone. And things will get heated and they will come close to fighting each other. But eventually, they will hug and share a few beers together. John Cena is currently not scheduled to appear at WrestleMania 35. But according to a recent rumor, that's because WWE wants it to be a surprise when John Cena actually shows up at the event and he is rumored to have a match with a WrestleMania legend, The Undertaker. The Undertaker has appeared at almost every WrestleMania since WrestleMania 7, and fans were worried that he may not appear at this year's WrestleMania. But he is set to have a surprise match with John Cena in a rematch from last year's WrestleMania. But this year, the match will be much longer as John Cena gives The Undertaker one last classic WrestleMania match. Braun Strowman's former tag team partner, Nicholas, whom Braun won the tag titles last year with at WrestleMania 34, will be returning at WrestleMania 35, along with The Tonight Show's Jimmy Fallon, and they will help Braun Strowman eliminate Colin Jost and Michael Che. Conor McGregor announced recently that he's retired from MMA. After the announcement, Roman Reigns said in an interview that he thinks Conor McGregor should come to WWE, but only if Conor is willing to wrestle for 205 Live only. This comment rubbed a lot of people the wrong way, but it also created rumors that Conor McGregor may show up at WrestleMania 35 this Sunday. Conor McGregor may confront Roman Reigns after Roman's match with Drew McIntyre, which will set up a future big match between Conor McGregor and Roman Reigns. It's been a very long time since we have seen Bray Wyatt, and at WrestleMania 35, Bray Wyatt will be returning to confront a longtime rival, but with a new gimmick. Bray Wyatt will interfere during the Finn Balor vs. Bobby Lashley Intercontinental title match, and Bray will cause Finn to lose. Bray Wyatt will show up with a new gimmick, Sister Abigail. Bray was supposed to feud with Finn Balor as the Sister Abigail character in 2017, but Bray had to take time off to recover from an illness, and the gimmick change was cancelled. Vince McMahon has repeatedly double-crossed Kofi Kingston in the lead-up to WrestleMania, as Kofi tried to get the championship match that he deserved, and at WrestleMania, he might be double-crossed again by Vince McMahon. According to a current rumor, Kofi Kingston will pin Daniel Bryan, as he believes he just won the championship. But just as the celebration gets underway, this McMahon will come out and tell Kofi that he forgot to mention that the match is actually two out of three falls, as Kofi gets double-crossed again. DX will be inducted into the Hall of Fame the night before WrestleMania, which means that DX members will most likely be in attendance at WrestleMania. And if a current rumor is true, fans can expect DX to interfere in the No Holds Barred match between Batista and Triple H. Elias will be performing at WrestleMania 35 in his own concert at MetLife Stadium. But there's been many rumors that Elias will be interrupted like he usually is. Elias will be interrupted by the Honky Tonk Man, and this will lead to the Honky Tonk Man hitting Elias with a guitar. Brutus the Barber Beefcake will then appear and cut Elias' hair. A few years ago, at WrestleMania 33, Rob Gronkowski helped Mojo Rawley win the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal. And this year, Rob Gronkowski, who recently retired from the NFL, will be a surprise entrant in the Andre Battle Royal at WrestleMania 35, where he will once again tackle Jinder Mahal and eliminate him from the match. Brock Lesnar will be defending his Universal title against Seth Rollins, but there are rumors that Brock Lesnar will be losing the title to Seth Rollins, because Vince McMahon has finally realized that not having a Universal Champion on TV every week is hurting the company. It's also rumored that at WrestleMania, after Brock loses the match, Vince McMahon will come out to the ring and fire Brock Lesnar, live on pay-per-view. And after that, Brock will move on to competing for UFC again.